Hi guys, it's Mrs. Murphy at the Upton Town Library. Today we're closed, so I thought I'd take this opportunity while it's quiet to show you our Spanish collection. If you're a student in the Menden Upton District, you might be a member of the Spanish Immersion Program and you're also looking for summer reading titles. Well, we have things that can help you out. This is our Spanish collection here at the back of the children's collection. All of these books you'll notice have this little red and yellow sticker that says Espanol. And that's how we know our Spanish materials here at the library. We've got a whole bookcase top to bottom full of materials for you. So let me show you what we've got. Down here, we start with our board books, Spanish board books. Not many, we're just starting this collection, but we've got a few to get you started. Then we move on to easy readers. Here's one that you might recognize, these characters, Elephant and Piggy. So all of our easy readers are marked Spanish easy, and they've got all these little white letter stickers on them, just like our regular easy readers do. You might find some titles you recognize like Fly Guy, and then you might find some new ones in here. So this was a series that we have called Digger and Daisy. Maybe you're not familiar with them. But it's a nice easy reader collection. And then we move up to picture books. So we've got a whole shelf just of picture books. And this is a blend of bilingual ones and single language picture books. And what I mean by that is some of them are written in both English and Spanish, and then some are just written in Spanish. So. Um, families that that might make a decision on which ones you choose for your kids. Here we've got our Spanish chapter books. We've got them all along the shelf marked by author. You might find some things you recognize here. Here's Charlie and the Chocolate Factory translated. We've got some authentic ones in here. The color of my words. And we've got some more difficult ones. This is Harry Potter. And then finally up top, we have our nonfiction. We've got a small collection of nonfiction topics here, and those are also organized by their Dewey Decimal number, just like our regular nonfiction ones are. So depending what topics you like, you would look for that number. So if you're looking for um, things about the human body, that's 612. We've got lots of different topics and we're adding to this all the time. Here's an example of a picture book I was talking about. This one is in both languages, English and Spanish. It's called Sing With Me, Canta Conmigo. So it's got the Spanish words and then the English words as well. This would be an example of one that is written only in Spanish and it's called Sopa de Cactus and it's a retelling of uh, stone soup, but cactus soup. Also down on our bottom shelf, we've got summer reading titles that are official to the district, starting with uh, the translation of Freckle Juice. And we've got what was Ellis Island. And then some of these titles here are just previous summer reading titles that might help kids choose something to read this summer. So we've got lots of things here in our Spanish collection to share with you. Top to bottom, this shelf, chock full, always adding to it. If you need any help or some suggestions, be sure to call the library during our regular business hours. The number is 529-6272. Our contact information with my email address and the directors are on our website, uptonlibrary.org. Um, we have curbside pickup three days a week right now, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, but we're usually here during our business hours anyways to answer the phone and help. So on that note, Happy summer reading.